I think it does start with a tone at the top. I believe that we have to hire the right skill base to be involved locally, right? So it's not just um, someone who has a technical background because that's what we do when we deliver networks. I want someone who can engage, can communicate, can be the face of Frontier in the community and who can make good leadership decisions on behalf of our company. So when we bought the properties from Verizon, especially in this area, they didn't have a general manager structure. They didn't have a local engagement structure. So we hired 80 new general managers around the country. And we put together a general manager university where we brought in our general managers from our existing properties to teach the new general managers how to be great general managers for Frontier. And I'm so pleased. We have 125 general managers today all around the country, and they do a terrific job with local engagement. And I expect them to be responsive to our customers in the marketplace, just like I'm responsive. And you know, again, I've got uh, you know over four million customers nationwide. I have 15,500 employees. I answer every email within 24 hours. And if a customer gets a hold of me, I call that customer immediately. So. I'm as, 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 as accessible as my general managers are because I have to set that example. Well, I have, um, you know, I have terrific human resource people that know the right profile. Uh, and I also have, uh, the, one of the great things about Frontier is we were in 23 states before this acquisition and we expanded to 27 states. So Indiana is a good example. We had employees here already. We had infrastructure here already. So I have local people on the ground that know what we need that can go into these communities and find great people to lead them. The other thing that we're very big on is we hire general managers for, from where we want them to lead. We don't parachute people in to the communities. We want people that know and have been intimate with that community for a long time. So we do try to find people in other jobs in those communities that we can entice and have them come over to Frontier. Well, I, I believe that it is the responsibility of businesses to create jobs in America. Uh, and Frontier is a 100% US-based workforce. We have no jobs overseas. When we did the Verizon acquisition, we actually brought 500 jobs back from India to the United States. We're also a priority hirer of vets and reservists. So 13% of my workforce are vets and reservists. And if you look at Fortune 1000 companies around the country, the average percentage of vets and reservists in those companies is 2%. And we've hired over 200 vets coming back from Afghanistan and Iraq in just the last six months at Frontier. So we believe in creating jobs. Since we did this acquisition, we've hired 1,400 new employees into the company. So I'm thrilled about that because those jobs are predominantly in rural America. And one of the things that is um, very positive for me, I go around and I go to a lot of our communities just like I'm here in Valparaiso because it allows me to see what does Frontier really need to do to help these communities thrive and to grow. And with all of the disarray and dysfunction in Washington DC these days, you know, you can be very disheartened about where America's headed, but when you come out to rural America, I'm not disheartened at all because people are working together to just make it happen. They're not expecting somebody else to do it for them. They are collectively bringing community leaders and business leaders together in public-private partnerships to grow jobs and to grow their communities. And I think that's what America's all about. So we are thrilled to be the leader in providing services to rural America. We think it's the heartbeat of who we are. And it's great for our employees because they have a lot of pride in their communities. And when they have permission from the company they work for to be active and to have that be part of who they are and their jobs, it's just a win-win for our employee base as well.